in this tutorial we will learn how to create a new user in Drupal website so first of all you have to go to people in your ad administrative menu so this is the tutorial for uh, Drupal 7 so once you will click on uh, people you will be shown this page so you can click on add user and over here you have to provide the email ID or uh, the username uh, so let's say it, uh, it could be uh, skilled interns and then uh, the email ID could be let's say this and then the password ensure that password has good strength so that it cannot be cracked easily and then uh, associate any rules which uh, you want so in case you have created multiple uh, rules in your website then you can choose okay which one of those will be uh, given or assigned to this particular user so every every user will have this authenticated user because um, authenticated means that uh, they have registered and they, we have verified their identity so now if you want to make this uh, uh, user an administrator then you have to check this one or else don't uh, and if you want to notify the user that okay the account has been created then a mail will be sent uh, to this particular email ID so in case if you click uh, check this then um, a mail will be sent to this from the website uh, saying that okay the new account has been created for you in this website now click on new uh, create new account so it says that unable to send email ID because this is a local host and we have to configure that but if you will use server web server then the mail will be sent to the respective email ID so this is how we create um, the new uh, user so if you go to people then we can see that skill interns is there uh, which has been member for 22 seconds and the status is active which means that uh, the user can uh, perform tasks which which um, his or her role uh, has the permission to so in case you want to check the permission of particular uh, role then you have to go to peep, uh, people and then permissions click on permissions so you will be shown all the uh, all the rules in the column and all the permissions in the rules so we can say that okay uh, view the administrative dashboard only administrators allowed to do that or perform that task and uh, anonymous or authenticated user is not or are not so same goes with the different kinds of um, text formats so we are giving access to only uh, filtered HTML text format to anonymous user and authenticated user while others uh, other text formats like uh, full HTML PHP code is not given to anonymous or authenticated user because it can have security implications so that was the process of creating new user in Drupal website thank you for watching the tutorial